everyone, and welcome to another episode of DI We'll See What Happens. And today we're going to be working on a bathroom. This project is special. I'm not in the house, I am in the garage where there is uh, an apartment that was built into it, a mother in law apartment. And my husband is currently using that as his office slash man cave. And it's pretty amazing. Um, if you like Lego. <laughs> so. <laughs> I'm trying to redo this bathroom. It was very. Uh, I don't want to say horrible. I'll put the before pictures on here and you can judge for yourself. It wasn't great though. So I am trying to take that bathroom and turn it into a manly man cave bathroom. Um, manly as an adult male who likes Batman a lot. <laughs> so everything's black and gray. This, the reason this is different is because I'm trying a couple things that I've never tried before. One being I'm painting the toilet. Painted toilet. <laughs> I just started. <laughs> Don't judge me. But it's actually coming out pretty cool. I'm using this appliance paint. And obviously I cleaned it. I'm not, I couldn't drain all the water out. So I'm not doing inside the bowl. I'm just doing kind of the outside. I put plastic in there to protect the white part. Um, and I I'm letting this portion dry before I continue the rest, but you can see it actually looks pretty nice. And I'm going to seal it afterwards with um, something that's supposed to, it's a spray epoxy oil based, so that'll work, hopefully. So I am doing the toilet and I'm also doing the countertop and the tile. <laughs> and I have three days, <laughs> so I'm not going to sleep at all. But I'm doing all the cabinets as well, making them black to match his, his black. The rest of the cabinets in the apartment are all black. So we're going to see what happens. I'll show you the finished product or I'll make another video when I'm working on the countertop. Well, I know I said that I was going to film again whilst I was working on the counter and I lied. Also forgot, <laughs> but I have not quite finished it yet. I just did the initial sanding and spray painting and I'm about to put the epoxy coat on it. Um, so this is the painted version. I wanted it to look like a dark stone and I'm actually pretty happy with it. It, it has some texture to it and it, it looks more like a stone than than it did before. So I'm going through the lengthy and tedious process of mixing this epoxy. I have to stir this for six minutes and put it in a clean cup and stir it for another six minutes. This is fun. I'm having fun. Anyway, once I get this on, I'll um, hopefully remember to film a little bit more while I'm putting it on and apparently it dries pretty quickly so I should be able to um, do the rest of the work that I have to do around the sink this evening without causing any damage. <laughs> Who wants to do this? <laughs> I'm still stirring. <laughs> but it brought to mind that you may actually want to know what I used. I'm going to set this down because I can't stop stirring. <laughs> to create this effect. And it is this multicolored texture stone spray paint, which I love, but it was a little too light. I didn't, I wasn't quite happy with the color, so I went over it. Um, just in spots kind of to create a, an effect with that same, with a, a spray chalk um, 
that I used on in combination with that appliance paint on um, the things <laughs> the towel rack and the little the little tiny towel rack and the toilet paper holder to give it kind of an industrial feel <laughs> by the way just so you know I do on occasion <laughs> brush my hair <laughs> I don't always look like this when I'm working on a project who gives a shit <laughs> I'm sure I'll have to bleep that out Safety note, I should be wearing gloves and goggles. I'm not trying to be cool and not use them because I don't care. I don't have any. <laughs> I must risk loss of limb. I'm still staring. <laughs> I'm watching the clock. Apparently we're doing this in order to heat it up and thoroughly mix it. onto the sink. I think it looks rather cool. So I'm gonna let that dry. Whilst I'm letting that dry, I'm going to spray the sealant I got for the toilet, um, which is this oil-based polyurethane. Um, and hopefully this will be dry enough for me to do all the rest of the crap that I have to do tonight because my husband will be home tomorrow and this is supposed to be a surprise and look amazing and right now it does not. I didn't spend a lot of time in the video going over how I did the floor but really I just cleaned the tile and used these two items and painted the floor, sealed it and this is how it came out so I was really happy with it.